so Monica Lane and I'm actually filming in the same spot. It looks like I might be filming somewhere else, but I'm at my bed. You can see my bed covering, but I'm at a beanbag chair and um, yeah. So I'm sorry I haven't been around lately, but I had prom last week and finals are coming up and my life has been so crazy, but today is a rainy day, so I thought I'd film. Alright, so I've been getting a lot of stuff lately. I went shopping and I actually have a basket, <laughs> kind of an ugly basket, full of stuff I want to show you. So let's just get right into it. Alright, so I got a lot of variety of different things. But the first thing I will show you is from Bath and Body Works. And these are um, the hand sanitizers. Because I'm obsessed with them. And like every girl in my school we have the little like jelly things that hold the hand sanitizers. And we have them attached to our book bags. Um, so this was a 5 for 5 sale. But um, one of them is on my book bag right now. And it is the green apple one. And I'm obsessed with apple scents, so these are the four I got. I got red, which is red apple, s'mores, apple pie, and cancer, which is the tangerine scent. And um, I love these all, and they all smell really good. I'm obsessed with apple scents, and yeah, so that's basically that. Alright, and another thing in kind of, I guess, the hygiene, I don't, I don't know how you explain it. It's hygiene area is... Um, I'm going to try these out. Are they 3D white strips? And I've heard they're really, really good. And I've always wanted to try them. Because I don't like the way my teeth look. Because when I was little, I didn't understand, like, the point in brushing teeth. Like, I brushed my teeth. But, like, I could have done better. So, I'm definitely going to try these out. And I'm really excited. And I'll tell you how that goes. Um, I also got a lot of hair products. Like, shampoos and stuff. And, um... I went on Garnier Fruit Teeth Spree because um, they were having like a sale and I got four, like two sets of shampoo and conditioner but I'm missing one of the bottles. I don't know where I put it. And the first ones I got are the Triple Nutrition, three nutri nutritive fruit oils for dry to over dried or damaged hair. And I just wanted to see if this really is as nutritional as it says. And um... Thought they'd be really good to check out, and um, I love Garnier Fruit Teeth, and I always change up my um, shampoo and conditioner about every, after I use a bottle up, I try to change either brands or like the kind that you're using, because they say otherwise it stops working effectively. And I also got their Pure Clean set, and this is just the conditioner, and I need to get the shampoo. Uh, well, I had the shampoo, but I don't know where I put it. So, um, this is the Pure Clean set, and it's all about like eco-friendliness. Sorry, I just kicked the camera. All about being eco-friendly, and I'm really into that stuff. Alright, another thing I got from Gar... I got two more things from Garnier Fruities, I think. Was the Garnier Fruities Full Control Anti-Humidity Hairspray in Ultra Strong number 3. And it looks like this, and this is their bamboo collection. And it's just got this little nozzle. And, um... My friend uses... I am just a makeup lover here on YouTube. She used this on me for um, prom, and I... It just held my... Like, my hair was stuck in the way it was. It was up in a bun and it was just stuck there like it couldn't move and this stuff is definitely really great so I wanted to try it out. And I got their Pure Clean Smoothing Cream for 24 hour frizz control because with summer coming you, I try out all the different frizz controls because I feel like the summer makes my hair frizzier. Yeah. So um, and this is part of their Pure Clean line about the eco-friendliness. I have two more hair products. Alright so I got the John Frieda Freeze Ease 3 Day Straight because I've heard a lot about this, and it's for, like, curly, wavy hair, and, um, I'm really excited, and it's in this purple packaging, but then it looks like this, and it's a little squirt bottle, and I'm really excited to use it. So, that's that, and, um, I've heard a lot of great reviews about this, so I'm excited to try it out, um, I'm hoping it works really well. And I also got the John Frieda Full Repair Sheer Mist to, it's supposed to, like, help enhance your like hair and stuff and um it comes in a red packaging all of their like full repair stuff which is supposed to like help like help damaged hair and inside it's like just a tiny bottle um i haven't used any of this stuff that i showed you so far yet but i'm really excited to try and use it it's just been too humid to actually straighten my hair so and i haven't like curled it like i've just been leaving it natural lately so i'm really excited to try this um john freed is a really great company and they make great quality, so I definitely would go check them out. Alright, let's go on to makeup. Alright, so I have a couple of new products of makeup that I got this month. So we'll start with this. 
these are the L'Oreal um, True Match Natural, part of the True Match Natural Collection. And this is the General Mineral Makeup, and it's SPF 19 Sunscreen. And this is the Soft Focus Mineral Finish. And I bought these together at the same time, and they're really good. So basically, I'm just going to show you what they do, like what the whole like packaging is. I think it's a really great idea. So it's this little bottle, container thing, and you take off the lid, and there's a brush. And I love these brushes. They're really soft and great. And then you open this up, and they have the mineral in there, and you're supposed to sweep this in here, pat it, put this down, and then just apply the makeup all over. I'm actually wearing it right now, and I really love it. And then the other thing is the mineral finish, which is like you put on after your makeup, I think. And I like this, too. You do the same thing. You just apply. So, yeah. I don't know why I just swept that on my cheeks. And I think these are great for travel because of, um... Because, like, they have the brush with them, so you don't have to worry about bringing brushes. Um... Next, I've got some... Oh, okay. So, I usually don't buy makeup from Forever 21 because I'm just scared that it'll make me break out and just because they're not known for their makeup and stuff. But I want a glitter eyeliner and I really, like, didn't want to spend, like, $18 on a little bottle of glitter eyeliner if I didn't know if I liked, like, if I liked glitter eyeliner look on me, you know? So, I went to Forever 21 and this was $3.80 and it's a pack of three glitter liners and it's from the Love and Beauty collection and it has this cute packaging. I just love the packaging. And it comes in gold, pink, and silver. And I've used them, and I actually really like these. So, like, I know, like, I wouldn't use Forever 21 makeup usually, but this is good. Um, it's cheap, so it's great for, like, going out on summer nights. And I'm definitely going to be purchasing the, I think, Urban Decay has a version of, a line of glitter liner, so I'm going to go to Sephora soon and buy this. Alright. Um, I needed a white eyeliner for, like, your tear line, I think it's called. And, um, so I went and got two NYC, these are 99 cents, and they're actually pretty good for 99 cents, like, that's really, really cheap, and, um, they're actually really good, I find that they come on pretty easily, um, they show up well, and I got them in the colors, uh, white, and, hold on, wait, why doesn't it have a name? Oh, in the Navy. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I definitely would try these out if you need a cheap liner. And they're big, so they definitely will last a while. Alright, um, I'm actually missing something. Okay. Alright, so I also got the two CoverGirl things. And I got the CoverGirl um, Smoky Shadow Blast. And I'm very, very happy with this purchase. The only thing I'm upset about is that this side actually broke. And it, like, comes out, and, like, I'm really upset about that. But I don't know if maybe I did something to it, so I'm going to definitely purchase another one, another color. But I love this, and the other side is still usable. And it's also great for travel and, like, summer because it's just, like, light makeup, and you can bring it anywhere, and it's just, it's an all-in-one thing. So I definitely like this. And I'm so excited about this purchase, guys. Like, you don't understand. I've been waiting to get this forever. The CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume Mascara. This was voted the best, um, like, one of the best makeups, best, it was voted the best day mascara in 2010, and I've been waiting to get it, I just always forgot to get it, and I finally got it, and I'm in love, guys, like, this make, this mascara is so amazing, and they make a waterproof version, so I'm definitely gonna go buy that, so that when I go to, like, the beach and stuff, and because I cry so easily, and whenever I go see a show, I cry, and I always have makeup done my face, so I'm gonna go purchase this in the waterproof. Guys, this is amazing. Go get it. And my last two makeup items were really exciting, and they are two of the new CoverGirl, um, lipsticks, and, okay, so I got two of them. And I was really excited because, uh, oh, the magazine's over there. Seventeen Magazine had this on the opening page of their, of, like, their, of the magazine, and it was with Taylor Swift. And I'm in love with Taylor Swift, guys. Like, I love Taylor Swift. Thumbs up for Taylor Swift, guys. And, um, so basically I went out and bought them because I heard they were good and because Taylor Swift. So, yeah. Um, so I bought in the color Delight 410, and it looks like this. And it's great. I'll do a little swatch of my hand to see if you guys can see that. So, 
And the coloring on the bottom definitely is true to color, so... Yeah. I don't know if you can see that, but... Yeah. And then I also bought it in the color... Spellbound number 325. And this looks like a really bright color, and it actually is. But bright colors are really in. Like, <laughs> it's funny. Bright colors are... Like, bright lips are in, and so... Bright lips and neutral. So it's like two opposites. So... And I'll do a swatch of that. And I'm in love with this. I actually recorded a video with this lipstick on, but then it ended up not looking good. But I love this color. It's the top one. And it's just so bright, and it, I think it's great for the summer because if you go with a simple outfit, like with the white outfits that are very in, you can just put this on, and it adds a little splash of color. And my last two things were very exciting purchases. I had my eyes on these, and I told my daddy. And he was like, okay, we'll go back and purchase them. And I did purchase these with my own money. And, um, we went back, and this is actually a Jessica Simpson bag, and it's so cute. It's the crossbody kind, and it's got a little knuck brass thingy, and it has the bow in the front, and I was just, I'm in love with it, because my old crossbody bag actually broke, and I don't know how that happened, don't ask. And I'm just, I was so relieved. And I also bought a Steve Madden purse, and I'm in love with this, guys. Like, do you see how cute this is? And it just in the basics and it's Steve Madden and I'm in love with Steve Madden and it has a lot of pockets and it also came with an extra strap in case you wanted to add it on but I don't really like it so but guys isn't this adorable yeah and those weren't even that expensive like because I got them at Macy's and Macy's was having like a 25% off sale <laughs> excuse me sale so um yeah they were like $75 total I think that was a great deal Alright, so that's all for today, and um, I hope you're having a great rainy day, or it might not be raining where you are, but I hope you're having a good day. Bye, guys.